Hey y'all, it's registered dietitian Robin Patera, and today we're making our next superfood recipe, garlic cauliflower mashed. So this recipe makes a great low carb alternative to regular mashed potatoes. And to start out, you're just going to dice up a head of cauliflower. You can use whatever size you like and just try to remove all the stems. And then once that's all diced up, you're going to just cook the cauliflower. So you can either microwave it or steam it until it's soft. Now I'm also going to add in one half of an actual potato. You don't have to do this. You can just use straight cauliflower but I'm going to do this to trick my boyfriend. So if you do just one half of a potato, the recipe will completely taste the same as mashed potatoes and you won't even be able to tell there's cauliflower in there. So I've steamed my potato and my cauliflower and then you're just going to peel the skin off the potato and dice it up somewhat small. Now to make the mash, there's actually three ways. One is you can just mash everything together by hand and that will come out a little chunkier if you like it that way. You can put it all into a food processor, which is sort of the traditional way. I'm actually going to try just using my blender today. We're going to see how this works. So I'm going to add the potato. And the cooked diced cauliflower. plenty of garlic. Optional here, you can also add some Parmesan cheese if you like. And then some chives, our next superfood ingredient of this week. And then finally, instead of butter, I'm doing a tablespoon of almond milk, or you can use any milk that you like. So then you're just going to pulse this up until it's all smooth. So I'm not going to lie, that was somewhat cumbersome. I kind of had to blend it up and then stir it and blend it again. So it might be easier if you just use a food processor, but regardless, it looks delicious. So I'm just going to transfer it to a bowl and you can garnish it with some more fresh diced chives if you like. And that's it. I hope you enjoy trying this recipe with your family.